So today I'm doing an EICR on a property and this is the main dis distribution board. So just to have a quick visual inspection of what we've got. So straight away, we've got our 25 mil tails coming in here. And if you can see, there's some brown tape on this meter tail. So that's hopefully not indicating that that is the line conductor because the line conductor should be this one. So obviously we'll confirm that when we check the um, polarity. Um, we have an RCBO on the non-RCD side. It's obviously a Wilex board and we have a steeple RCBO. So again, that's incorrect. Really, it should be an RCBO. If you look at the buzz bar, a clip here is broken off. So again, structurally, maybe the integrity of the board is a little bit not great. We've got a broken part of the board here as well. So these are just things that I'm just picking up on a first initial inspection. Looking at the top of this one, this looks a bit loose. Now I reckon a little bit of wiggle around that could even pull out. So we would obviously need to check the tightness of the conductors. We've got the this earth cable here not doing anything it's just laid in there and again the main earth terminal is not secure neither can you see anything else i think they're the main things that i can see on the board if you look underneath the board the ip ratings look okay from underneath but if we look closely at this gland here, how the gland has been earthed is just a bit of one mil cable. So again, that's not, not great. Let's look at the top of the board. So again, IP rating here should be IP4X on the top surface. So again, that's not, that's not complying. And again, on the cables there, so that's that we need to just sort of something do something with that um, if you look on this one this board was undone and it looks like there's been a load of cables joined whether they've been joined with connector blocks or just taped up I don't know but that's something that we've got to investigate and if you look down below there's a load of cables cut off so could be an old storage heaters, so uh, old storage heater circuit possibly. But anyway, that's what I've seen seen first off. Quickly to add to the when I was saying about the initial inspection of checking a visual inspection, and, and, and we picked up things like this. Um, this, this connection here and the RCBO and IP ratings etc. I've just gone to put this buzz bar cover back on and one of the things I noticed when I took it off had this screw in it and I didn't really pay too much attention to it but anyway I've just gone to put it back on and, and noticed that you know that I said about these clips being broken etc. Well it turns out that that screw is a bit screwed through this hole here and somehow that had broken it off and so it was pressed up like that and you can see how it was and so that was there through there and so that had screwed through the buzz bar hole and I couldn't quite believe that's how it had been done but I have just done it myself and screwed it up just to see and, um, and apparently that's how that's been done. And also this was tested a few, uh, in 2016 and it said it was okay till 2025 or something like that. So it obviously hadn't been tested properly um, back then because not much has changed um, according to the owner of the property since that test was done. <laughs> 